Hey everyone, this is Brian with OBDM PC Audio Labs, and today we're going to do a quick unboxing and overview on the Focusrite Scarlett 6i6 second generation 6 input, 6 output USB audio interface. Um, includes a lot of cool stuff with the interface, uh, which you're going to notice on the packaging right here. It includes Ableton Live Lite, some plugins from Softube, and also Pro Tools first to allow you to get started with Pro Tools. So there's a lot of uh, software included in the Scarlett 6i6, which is quite cool and a really great way to be able to get started. I'll give you guys a look at the back packaging here. So let's go ahead and unbox the Scarlett 6i6 and show you what is inside. All right, so inside the box, we're going to find our Focusrite 6i6. Now, I've already taken the plastic off of this because I just want to be able to quickly show this to you guys. I'm going to put that aside for just one moment here. You'll find your power adapters, your power adapter, should I say, and the power adapter is also going to have uh, international adapters as well. So you'll be able to use this elsewhere besides the United States. And you'll also find hidden away here a little bit inside of this piece of cardboard a signature red USB cable. Focus right signature red because that's their color is red. Now what you will notice is that there's no DVD or CD included here. And that's because all of the software that you are going to get with the 6i6, you're going to download from the Focusrite website. So let's just look at the interface real quick. Uh, first of all, first impressions, it just looks awesome. It's, it's just, it's really awesome. I mean, there's something really cool about Focusrite interfaces. Uh, you know, they have the brushed red aluminum. They really stand out. You know when you're seeing a Focusrite audio interface, which I think is, uh, you know, is really cool. Let's take a look at the interface itself. On the front, we have two combination inputs. These are combination because they're going to allow you to plug in not only XLR, but also quarter inch inputs and devices into these inputs on the front. We also have a gain knob for each of these. They're nice and rubberized. They don't turn incredibly easily, but they feel just nice and tight, easy to turn and use. They're not clicky. They are smooth turning. But they do feel really solid. You also have a 48 volt switch allowing you to engage 48 volt phantom power. Moving on to the right side, we have our monitor knob. Nice, big, silver, again, moves very nicely, not clicky, but just feels really solid. And then we have two headphone outputs, number one and number two, and dedicated gain for both of those, which is really great. We also have a MIDI input indicator and a USB sync indicator as well. On the back, we have our nice clicky power switch, AC power input, SPDIF output and in, USB port, MIDI out and MIDI in, both 5-pin MIDI right there. Line outputs, and these are line outputs 1, 2, 3, and 4. And then we have uh, inputs 3 and 4 here as well. So you might be asking, well, how is this a 6-in, six 6-out six interface if I've only seen a total of four ins and four outs, four physical ins and four physical outs. Well, that's because the rest of that's gonna happen on SPDIF. So physical input and output wise on this device, you get four inputs and four outputs, four of each. It's not a full six in and six out physical ins. And that's something that some folks might not necessarily like. And it's not 100% clear from the name right off the bat because it is marketed and sold as a six in, six out device. So you have to keep in mind that SPDIF is gonna play a role in that. For some folks that's gonna work and for others that's not going to be useful at all. Let's just face it, some of us never use SPDIF and may never use SPDIF. So if that's a deal breaker for you, you may end up looking at a different Focusrite audio interface in order to get more physical inputs. But if it's not, you still got four. And some of those obviously are on the back. 
And then, of course, if you need that many outputs, you know, you have the option for it. Not many of us are going to need any more than a standard stereo output, but sometimes you do need more than that. And that's where SPDIF can be really useful because SPDIF is super easy to use to plug into multiple devices for output. So that's where I think that could be kind of useful. That's basically everything that there is to see on the Scarlett 6i6. Again, it's, it's a fairly straightforward device when you come right down to it. Comes with a lot of software, which is really cool. I do think that potentially one of the deal breakers there for some folks could be the fact that since it is marketed, marketed as a six in, six out device, but actually only has four of each of those, I, you know, I feel like that could maybe be a little bit of an issue for some folks. I don't really have an issue with that. And I love the fact that it has discrete headphone outputs because that's a really big deal. Um, but that's just something to keep in mind. If you need more ins and outs, you may end up looking at another audio interface. But that right there, guys, is the Focusrite Scarlett 6i6 audio interface. It's a USB audio interface coming to you from our friends at Focusrite. Now, if you guys have questions or if I've missed anything, uh, if you want to know more, anything along those lines, please feel free to get in touch with us on your favorite social media network here on our YouTube channel, anywhere that you can find myself and Obedient PC Audio Labs. We'll be happy to talk to you guys and answer your questions. As always, everyone, I am Brian with Obedia and PC Audio Labs. Thank you for tuning in, and we'll see you next time. Take care. Today's pro audio hardware and software can give you excellent results if you know how to use it properly. Obedia can help you to get the most out of your pro audio hardware and software. Why spend your time scouring the internet for answers or digging through manuals? With one quick call to an Obedia technician, you'll be connected with someone who can give you the answers that you need in real time via phone and remote desktop. Obedia technicians are trained in all major digital audio applications on Mac, PC, iOS, and Android devices. Obedia member subscriptions are cost effective, give you great member benefits, and Obedia is here seven days a week to help you get the most out of your digital audio hardware and software. No matter what your level of expertise, Obedia can help you to stay focused and productive and get your music back on track. Start taming your technology today with Obedia.